I am very happy that between four and five million Kenyans will by end of uh, uh, by beginning of November they will be out of the black listing. That is very important. Very important because these four million Kenyans have been excluded from any formal borrowing because of blacklisting and they have been left at the mercy of Shylocks and predatory lenders that exploit them and many Kenyans pay as much as a thousand percent for credit. The fact that they will now be out of that space is a very positive development and I want to commit here that the government of Kenya is not against credit listing or credit bureau uh, facilities. In fact, we support CRBs as a mechanism of instilling financial discipline in our financial sector. What we are asking and I think we are on the same page on this, and I've had a long conversation with the governor. What we are asking is we don't want credit listing to be an all or nothing, in or out engagement. We want credit listing to be a facility that gives everybody a chance to be their best in their own time. Instead of saying you are in or out, we should have a credit scoring mechanism so that we have graduated from the least to the best. And everybody can have a chance, even if you are somewhere at the bottom, you can always walk your way up as you learn the ropes in the financial sector. So. Um, I am happy Governor has told me they are having engagement with the CRBs so that we can change the credit uh, listing mechanism. Instead of blacklisting, we can have a graduated mechanism that allocates rating on every citizen that is borrowing in the manner in which they have borrowed and in the manner in which they have paid back. That happens even for countries when we are borrowing money from IMF, from the World Bank. That is a universal principle of rating people on, or scoring people on uh, matters uh, credit. So that development is a very, develop, a very positive uh, development for the millions of Kenyans who suffer great loss they are excluded from for, uh, formal borrowing and they are also excluded from many other things. Some people lose jobs, some people lose opportunity to be hired because when they are asked to bring their uh, credit uh, listing uh, uh, status, if you are blacklisted then you are told you are not a very good person. So that will now redeem close to 4 million Kenyans, and I want to say to Safaricom and your partners, you're walking in the right direction.